How did the United States Civil War lead to the creation of new postage stamps? Well, after the Southern states seceded, there were still many thousands of dollars of United States postage in Southern post offices. Many in the North were concerned that people would take the postage stamps from the South, smuggle them across enemy lines, sell them, and use those profits to finance the Southern War effort. So what the North decided to do was create all new postage stamps in order to replace the ones that existed prior to the war. So over the course of a couple of months, the United States designed brand new postage stamps. Here you can see a die proof of one of these new stamps. Here you can see a specimen that was created in advance of their release to the public. And what happened is there was about a week long window in every post office where citizens could take their old stamps and swap them out for new stamps. And after this date, the old stamps would no longer be valid for postage. So here's a letter sent slightly before the start of the Civil War with the old style 10 cent stamps on it. And here's one sent after the outbreak of the Civil War with the new 10 cent stamp on it. The differences are subtle, but you can see them if you look closely and postmasters were trained to spot these differences so they didn't accept the demonetized pre-Civil War stamps for postage. So the Civil War is often told in terms of battles and you think about the movement of troops, but next time you stop and reflect on the Civil War, remember that even the postmaster general had to figure out what to do.